Hello and welcome back to a commentary on Clanad episode 23. This is the English subbed version and this is non-blind. I botched the intro because I hit uh, play before, well, kind of, as I started to record and speak. Uh, so I botched that. So that's awkward. Anyhow, my name is Cool Guy for you. So let's get to this. Go. So we got this episode, and then we got the OVA, I believe, and then we're gonna be done with our first anime reaction. Well, commentary. I, I prefer to call it commentary. Man, we still got it low quality. This is not fun. So Nagisa and Tomoya are talking. They are. They are so cute together. There was a confession last episode. Since you're a, a very s important person to me. Oh wow, that's being forward. Oh look at how look at how embarrassed she is. Hey, she just spazzes out. Ah, uh, uh, hold hands. Someone might see us. Oh, they're being so cute. See, this is this is what it should have been like, for, you know, maybe four or five episodes. So Desune. Oh, he's... he's. They're like shaking. They're just about to hold hands and Kayo interrupts. Of course she would. Were you two about to kiss? Baka! We're just, we were just going to hold hands. <laughs> Kayo digs what the, she sees there. Anyhow, that was that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Um, so now we're in the, we're going through the intro. Let me just look through my notes, um, my review notes. While there's, it's just the intro, um, the the opening, not the intro, the opening. Um, where is it? Where is it? Right there. Um. Um Man, this show had a lot to plow through. Uh, I still got to write more notes on that that one part. All right. We're back. We are back. So he's still staying at Nagisa's place. So summer break, but they still have some sort of classes. He doesn't skip because of Nagisa. Episode twenty-three: the something of summer holiday, the vacation of summer holiday. I can't read the subs. Supplementary classes. Kayo eating broccoli or something. Cute. Ryo isn't confident enough. Kayo, Kayo has such a more likable personality. I think she's. I think she's the secondary favorite outside of Nagisa. If it wouldn't have been Nagisa, I think people would have primarily chose Kayo. Even though she didn't really get a story arc. Including the sister. Star food. Starfish food. Where's Fuko? Oh, they're ta they're talking about her relationship to Tomoya. If they're dating or not. 
How far have you two gone? Oh gosh, they're 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 wanting to know all the details of everything. They haven't even held hands. Baka, baka, you gotta hold hands. What did Sunahar say? Did he say that one thing? He has a guest. A really cute girl. Wants to meet him. It's going to be his sister. Spoilers. Sorry to make you wait. Oh, <laughs> it's his sister. And he passes out. Yep. Yeah, good grief. So, May or Nay has returned, whatever her name is. And they're cleaning his room again. What was I, what was I going on about? Darn it. With the progression of the commentary, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, Sunahara says something like, they're in high school or whatever. And... You know, there. It, it's too much to explain. You don't have to push too much sexual stuff that early. Good grief! But holding hands and kissing is fine. Other, I was more so than that. Keep it within the bounds of marriage. That's why what it's de everything's designed for. And that's how things properly should be. So, Nay or May or whatever her name is, is staying with the parents of Nagisa as well. So, she looks really different with her hair different. That sounded intelligent uh, without her hair in her typical style with her hair just down like that she looks really different I I think I know the contents of this episode I'm looking forward to the ending because I want to commentate on the ending of this episode Can't go out with you despite the break. They're too busy working in the bakery. Akio being awesome. Though, he does always have that cigarette and smoking. That's not cool. They portray it as cool, but it's not cool. That's complete garbage deception. They try and addict you on it. Stay the heck away from it. They even have in the movies like Cowboys and stuff. Oh, to be cool, you smoke. No, 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 it's it's a trap. It's a deceptive trap. Oh. Oh, Nay tried one of the cookies and she comment she commented on how it looks rather than how it tastes. Yoroshiku on the guy shimas. Smart. That little girl is smart. Junk collector. Oh, and to get... Oh, to get customers. Okay. I remember. I'm, I want to jot down my final notes for the review, but... Konnichiwa. And I forgot my drink. Water. It's good for you. Arigato gozaimasu. Arigato gozaimasta. It's interesting. Depending on the um, lighting in here, it doesn't usually show up too, too different on camera. Um, a small amount of lighting difference, but it takes a, a large amount of lighting difference to actually show. 
otherwise it doesn't look that different. Like when it's perfectly bright out, midday, it's pretty much the same as it is when it's getting dark, but once it's totally dark, then it will look really different in here on recording. All right, so people aren't really interested in coming into the bakery. So dudes are coming into the shop hitting on Nagisa. Tomoya runs out mad at May. What are you saying to call customers in? We've got cute girls. Works every time. She is such an evil genius. They're getting so much business in there. She's telling more of them. The whole place is packed. People are pushed up against the windows. Buying food just because of a girl. That's how much a girl can affect a guy. The cash register is packed with cash. They made boatloads. May is a genius. Akio dodged the bread question. Why don't you say it to Okazaki? Nagisa, skida. Oh, so embarrassing. She. That's a good thing. May. Uh, did that nudge towards them and their bonding and pushing them forward. Kind of like how Fuko was doing quite a long time ago. So now we're at Sunahara's place again with Tomoya and the cat. It's messing with the cat. So, Kone. Konnichiwa. And I'm going to have some criticism for Season 2. That'll be interesting to come up with a review for Season 2. May kicks Sunahara out of his own room so she can talk to Okazaki alone about things. Doshitendo. Maika. She decided to become the Cupid of Love. Hi, Soka. Ipari. So it's about Sunahara. They established that. Not a suitable partner. What are you talking about? There's one right here. Ugh. Sunahara and May. <sighs> Incest. They're totally got. They totally are thinking two different people. And here we go. It's playing out in his mind. Oh my goodness. Like things I never even thought about when you were around. Not exactly like that. In a more naughty way. Um, you're such a naughty girl, Onicha. Oh, <laughs> what the heck? Tamoya, come on. What the heck is wrong with you, Tamoya? Please don't imagine such a terrifying thing. I said I'm the Cupid. Wait, then you're here for me? Hi. Oh my good gosh. Now he's imagining him and Sunahara hooking up. I'm starting to think about you a lot these days. How so? Like things I never even thought about when I'm around other people. Or dudes. No, not exactly like that. More like more like I want to wear matching boxers with you as we run down the school road or run to school down the road. Come on, catch me. Hey, don't play Oh my goodness. Catch me. Oh you oh oh uh, <laughs> That's that's good, Tomoya. That's good. Um Oh, 
Okay, so now she makes the two parties known. Him and Nagisa. She wants them to be more straightforward to one another. They need to progress. Junior high school girl lecturing him. How would he like her to be? Let's see. She thinks negatively, so he wants her to have more confidence. So she thinks similar. So this will work well. She sets something up. Oh my, speak of the devil. What a coincidence. She's got her hands up like she's innocent. Very good psychology. So she takes off. Nagis is here in a very pretty white dress. Very cute. Oh no. Tomoyakun. Oh, that sounds so nice and cute. Tomoyakun. You got the this. Oh, they're going for a walk. That's that's pretty good. I felt like walking with you. Too much to ask? No. Tomoya, you're super lucky. How so? Since you're walking with a slightly cute girl like me. Oh no, even though I say cute, it's only slightly. He's not picking up. He should have totally... Let's go home. Right off the bat? The plan won't work. Plan? Yeah, this is set up. This is a setup. It's to try and influence Tomoya to be more forward. Nagisa wills him to be more forward or may wanted them to be advanced a little bit. Holy heck, what kind of yeah, that's not bread. That's a landmine. I wouldn't eat that. Oh gosh, he's really taking to Tomoya right there. I'll spell everything out for you then. When I say landmine, it's Sunai's bread. She's right there. He just called her cooking a landmine. I love them. I will pay properly. She picks something out. Oh, the 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 the, 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 the muffin. She doesn't have the money. He wants him to pay for food. That's a very Pay for me. She was wondering if he was upset. Really? Then I'll have to say it again. I didn't hear you well. Please listen carefully. You paid for me, so I'm sure you're not upset about it or anything. Did you hear me clearly this time? She's so... She's so not... She is actually not confident, and she's nervous. All right, here here we go, here we go. We're getting closer. Is it good? Nervous. She can't taste it. She, why are you nervous? Oh, Tamoya. So it's better than usual. This is so cute. This is the kind of stuff that should have been like laid out for like four or five episodes. At least like the two final episodes here and then the three next ones in the second season. If they would have been like that, that would have been a warm welcome. You need to see us. Do you want a bite? Yeah. You do? But I won't let you. He tries to play into her cards and then she reverses it. She's 
it's she's not getting there with him. I'll have you enjoy it in a different manner. Just do whatever you want. Then please look this way. He's going to enjoy the food. That is allusion towards a kiss scene. <sighs> um, how was that? She blew in his face. I'm sure you smelled the cinnamon roll. She's so nervous. Mom, if you don't say something, I'll feel like crying. Come on, dude. He spotted me. That music. That music. He figured it out. Too unnatural. The date ends here. She takes off. That music. That music. Don't make me tear up. Dun 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 dun. Did she say something to you? She said because Okus is a delinquent, he can't force himself to be proactive. She also said that I should take the lead since I am the older one. I figured it was something like that. So I acted as Mei Chan planned. That music. That music, that soundtrack. I'm sorry I had become a strange girl, hadn't I? She's so nervous. Really strange. Do you not like me anymore? Takes her hand. How would I not like you because of something like that? Plus, what Mei Chan said probably isn't wrong. Do you still have some time, Nagisa? Th there's still some time until dinner. She's so embarrassed. Red face. Then let's go for a walk. Where do you want to go? Anywhere. Um, as long as it's with Tomoya Kun. You got the. I'm glad to hear that. That scene, that that shot right there. I'll always be with you. That shot right there of them close like that. A plus, A plus, A plus. All right, here's the outro. So thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for more clan ad commentary. I think we got one more to go for this season, and then that wraps it up, which I'll be very happy about. Um, and if you want to subscribe, doing so enters you into the cool clan. So. You can also do that. Oh boy. That was really cute. That was getting really quite cute. And those are the kind of things that should have been uh, like five episodes of the whole show. Something like that. Of them and a bit of progress here and there. And them being all like that, Nagisa being way nervous and stuff, and Tomoya being kind of clueless to it, and Nagisa wanting the the progression, and then Tomoya eventually plays into it, because he realizes it. Um, and I guess a general criticism of this season one, considering the next episode is a OVA, and, it, and it's a different kind of thing, it's a different route, um, a general criticism of mine could be that there wasn't you know, really a kiss scene between them this season, which probably would have been nice. Um, so that's probably a general criticism. Anyhow, thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for more Clan Ed commentary and take her cool.